Hey guys, in today's video I want to share my vision how to get out of depression. I have some theses as always, and the first is how to get out of depression. You should A. Have an external resistance. B. To live in the moment now. C. Do not have a global but pleasant goal. D. Normalize the dopamine system. What have an external resistance means? I, I want to start with what is depression? How it comes to our lives. Depression is a condition of our vision to this world. We see only bad things. We feel ourselves badly. Like when you're in depression, all what is in this world is really bad, you think. Why does it come to our lives? I'll give you a scenario. You have a bad day once. You have a bad day twice. And so on and so on. You have a rut of depression cycle and uh, you fall into it on months, on years maybe and uh, you just think that all in this world is wrong and maybe I'm wrong, maybe I'm so bad person, I feel bad and so on and so on. When you're in depression you have a lot of thoughts. If you're a pessimist or optimist you should have an energy to create these thoughts. When you have some cares in your life, maybe you working, you're studying, you put this energy on what you should do now and you do not put this energy to create bad thoughts. Uh, and it's about an A uh, thesis, have an external resistance. You should not think about something, you should do something. I think you've got my point. And uh, the B point is to live in the moment now. When you live in the moment now, you see world, how it's really going. You just don't care about your past and your future. You uh, have a vision into now, into now moment. C. Do not have a global but pleasant goal. When you realize that you're in depression and you want to get out of it, you think that I will go to the gym, I will start to eating better and it's all gonna happen now. But it's not working like that. You will fall into depression again because you should have a lot of energy to uh, change your life. And what I recommend you to do is have a, as I said, have a pleasant goal. Just a little goal which you can do just now. Just now I can uh, pull up twice. It's so easy for me. It's like drink from this glass some water. And you can just walk outside for 15 minutes per day, every day. And you will start changing your lifestyle by doing some something what you can do so easy. And Day by day, month by month, you will see the, the happiness which is increasing. And D, normalize the dopamine system. For example, when you uh, eat a chocolate bar today and you're in depression, you eat it for uh, increase your happiness. And for increasing your happiness today, you should eat one chocolate. Day by day of eating chocolate, you will increase your points of dopamine which you which is enough to make this level which was a day before so you should normalize your dopamine system how you can check my video about 30 days of no fab uh, it's the one way to stabilize your uh, your dopamine system it's a lot of factors you can check this out by yourself but it's something which you should know and the second thesis is you have a choice either you die quietly or do something i have a video about responsibility you should realize responsibility for your life you chose to be in the depression maybe you do not understand it but it's true just check my video about uh, responsibility i opened this thesis pretty good you can choose to live a good life be a, be an optimist but you decided to be a pessimist. So it's only your choice. And the third thesis is 
broken dopamine system is a consequence of a wrong mindset. You decided to be pessimist, so so you're trying to increase your happiness level by by some some drugs like uh, like sugar, like coffee. But the cause of your consuming of your drug con consuming is your mindset. I hope you understand it. And the last thesis is uh, without depression we wouldn't know what is happiness. I believe that we live in the dual world with uh, good and bad, with war and peace and so on and so on. It's always two fortresses. If you're in depression now, just imagine how is it cool to live just, just simple life without a depression. Just simple life with your family, with your friends, just living, not having yachts or watches just living a simple life you're gonna be happy because you had an experience about depression and you can and you can compare this experience and that thanks for watching we have a social network for personal growth named betley.life link in the description sign up and goodbye